Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is 2009 ADD. Where we left off, we went down to sector uh, section A of the Alpha Labs. So now we're in sector two, and uh, this is a mess as usual. So we're gonna continue. I have no idea what that is. Here at the UAC, we make okay. Oh my goodness, the demonic zombies. Where are you going? Okay, well, uh, yeah, movable zombies. What else is in here, huh? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh. Nope, not today. Not today. Oh, no, reloading. There you go. We're good, we're good. Well, double teamed again. It's like there's nothing that these guys can't do, huh? Alright. So, demonic beings moving around dead bodies. Because they have no respect for the dead. Not only that, wh whatever whatever this thing was eating just drops body parts. Fantastic. There you go. No problem. All right, where's my okay. I hear footsteps that is not mine. Not the bathroom, not anything but the bathroom. Look at this place. Okay. Is always thinking up behind me? No. Good break. Hello, hello, is this reaching anyone? I'm broadcasting on a very low frequency. If you can hear me, I'm not far. Please help me. I've locked myself in storage room C4. Please, if anyone can hear me, please help me. Okay. Yeah, I'm not that dumb. I know. I know you're gonna be hiding somewhere. There's stuff around like this? No way. Nice try. Okay. Continuing our little journey through the vents. Damn, disgusting. Ah, so lucky I can shoot you through the through the vent. Alive, dude. Why would you let him eat you? Why would you do that? Did you agree to that? Why would you agree to that? <laughs> Gross, man. All right, I'm gonna save right now. Second two. Okay. There we go. 
man. Disgusting, man. Oh yeah, that's totally cool. I, I mean, yeah, I could let you guys do what you want, but I mean, don't, don't put, don't get me involved, man, you know. That's where I am. Oh, oh, look at that. Parallel. <laughs> can I see the third? Me? I think I can. Yeah, I can. Oh, my goodness. Oh, all right. Well, anyways, junctions. Okay. Okay. Stars. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> That's cool. Alright, let's keep going since uh, I didn't lose that much health. Oh, I forgot. Andrew Chen. Let me check uh, his PDA. Let's see. Audio report regarding the disrespectful treatment of new research staff. September 14th, 2145. As you know, I have gone to considerable effort to recruit my staff researchers for Alpha Labs. Finding team members with the qualifications, let alone the willingness to come to Mars, has not been a trivial task. You know this already. But it is necessary that I emphasize why their complaints must be taken seriously. We won't be able to keep our people or recruit new researchers if the harassment continues. No, harassment is exactly the right word. I'm routinely getting reports of UAC security asking inappropriate questions and submitting my staff to unnecessary background checks. I must insist that we be allowed to keep our personal lives and be left to complete our assignments without further delay. If there is some type of security threat, I suggest that UAC security look more deeply into their own security. This is Andrew Chin, and... I just realized that there is no oxygen in there. What is up with that room? There's no oxygen. fuel to make the dream of deep space research a reality. The answer has been a resounding yes. Under the direction of Dr. Malcolm Batruga, key UAC scientists have made startling new discoveries in the fields of quantum physics. And with them, they have been able to use the actual space between electrons and protons in a molecule as a storage medium for fuel in our interplanetary antimatter drives. Now, fuel that would once take up half the payload of an interplanetary ship only occupies a fraction of that space. You are looking at the molecular fuel storage compactor. The MFS compressor is yet another UAC marvel that brings the dream of reaching and colonizing the most distant planets closer to a reality. The UAC has long made safer worlds for everyone, and now they will bring those worlds even closer than you could ever imagine. Guys, where are you going? Guys, I'm here. Move, move, move! Hey, I'm here, man. No. Team reports they've located your position but are unable to move to your current location. Head through engineering and try to link up with them in sector three. Whoa. Just, uh... 
check out who's this uh, Walter Connors character. Audio log for Walter Connors. The MFS compressor is producing fantastic results. The latest modification I made to the dilation matrix were the real key to the recent breakthrough. All in all, I feel my work on this project has been the catalyst that propelled everything forward. I've also taken a set amount of time each day to make sure that everyone is doing their job, and of course I check all of their data to ensure that no mistakes are made. This is going to be a huge moneymaker for the company, and quite honestly, without my input and hard work, I am not sure that we would have gotten this far. I wanted also to thank you for your supervisory role in the project. Working with you is a true honor. Just remember me in the end of the year reports, as I'm certain I deserve a promotion. Uh, Walter out. Yeah, you wish. Oh, really? Huh. Uh, that was Captain 39. Audio report. Re Repairs and 38 has been completed. The door is no longer stuck. Oh, it's 409. Okay. 409. that? Okay. right now is I have. Should be okay for now, hopefully. Saving. Let's just hope for the best. Sugar, say you meant. Sugar. Don't shoot. Uh, I can help you. The lights are all out. Uh, I'll lead you through here if you can get me off this base. I don't know if I could do that, man. Come on. I can't wait. Yeah, you can. I mean, how far would you go without me? <laughs> You're my guest. Hurry up! We can't stop! You know what? I never tried a grenade. Let me try a grenade. Electromagnetic pulses have knocked out the electrical systems in this area. Watch out. A big one could knock out our lights. Hope not. <laughs> it's as dark as it is. There's one. Oh, no. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Oh boy, I can't wait until a monster comes out of nowhere. And just sticks some time. Can't wait. Oh, what was that? I don't know. Ghosts? Stay close. I'll be in front of you so they don't get in front of mine. Get me. 
Oh, it was all good though. Oh, you got. How do you die? What? Wow. That was scripted for you to die. I have no idea. Sorry. I told you you're, uh, you couldn't survive this. Okay. I see something over there. That's the team. That is what is that? Oh. I thought that's an armor shirt. It's okay. easy. <laughs> I just feel bad that I didn't save that guy. Oh well. Here it is. Okay, I think I remember. Oh, wait. One, oh, two, three. Wow, that was nothing. I guess thanks for the clip, but I mean, that was it. Just in case. I don't want to lose any progress here. Go the big room. Yeah. What are you? Guys, I don't know if you saw it, but it looked like it had a mouth. Uh, yeah, a spider mouth. Jeez, jeez. Ow. Hey. Oh, I'm gonna die. Nope. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. <laughs> no, not settings. Oh. Dang. It got me good. Second death. Or was it there? Oh, I don't even remember. Darn. I think those guys are worse than the... than those two-headed skull-looking monster. Oh, great. Oh, okay, so I 
know, so I didn't quite as long as I can. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Get some, get some, get some, get some. Exactly. <laughs> That's okay. You got through it. One, one retry. Oh, and that's it. Cool. I'm done. Sector three. All right. That was easy. Easy until the ending. That was it. <laughs> Just the spiders. That's it. Oh man, I hope I don't have to fight more of those spiders. Okay. Just kill that thing, that's it. Alright. Well, I guess I'm gonna leave it here, guys. Uh, it was a crazy ride in Sector 2. Now, hopefully, after this one, uh, we can catch up with, uh, with Bravo and um, join up with them. But uh, I'm pretty sure they're gonna die, so I hope you guys like this Let's Play and see you guys next time.